The last question is, what are your plans for the summer? And this one is by HTTP dot totally insane. Okay. Dollar. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm gonna follow that. You what? I'm going to follow that. You're going to follow that? <laughs> totally insane. That's awesome. Let's be crazy. I have high expectations. HTTP dot totally insane. Just so you know. Probably we hope private. for insanity. Yeah. Mm. Um, so totally private. My, <laughs> totally. <laughs> <laughs> my plans this summer. Um, I have two weddings to go to. Oh. Are you in one of the weddings? No. Both of the weddings. No. Family weddings Neither or one. friend weddings? Uh, have you seen Wedding Crashers? <laughs> No, kidding. I have seen Money well, Crashers. That's not movie. what I'm doing, <laughs> uh, unfortunately. One is actually tomorrow. I don't know if that's considered like summer. Yeah, um, it's after Memorial Day. Summer. June 21 yeah. is the first so, day of not summer. Not really summer, so but the, one the second one is in July. So that's summer. <laughs> For uh, sure. Can't confirm. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be here in the summer. Yeah, <laughs> hopefully, still. Um, today's your last day. Today, yeah, yeah. <laughs> just in case you didn't know, whoops. Last <laughs> podcast, just going hard. Jeez. Uh, my family has a beach house in Hampton. Uh, Humble brags. Love it. <laughs> so we're going up there for a week for the 4th of July. Just a nice. week? I'd be up there all summer. Will we share it with all my um, cousins on my dad's side? Yeah, and my dad has out. five... <laughs> I don't know that's how it works, but <laughs> we have a lot of cousins and a lot of family, so everyone gets like one week during the summer, and oh, it's cool. just enough. And then I'm going to Canada in August for my grandparents' 60th anniversary. Oh, nice. Yeah, 60 years. So we're all going up there on my mom's side, so nice. it's going to be a lot of people in Canada. 12-hour drive with everyone. Ooh, get on the bus. Get on a CX bus. party bus. <laughs> oh, yeah. Mm. Be like, Joe, can I borrow the bus? I'm going to Canada. <laughs> We don't have a we bus. We still need to get the bus. <laughs> yeah, we gotta get the bus. Just okay. you a toy. Canada tape at a wedding. <laughs> yeah. That's pretty good. So, yeah. are you like a are you friend in the wedding or family in the wedding? Uh, well, the one that's actually in the summer, it's my cousin getting married. Nice. The one tomorrow is my boyfriend's brother. Oh, so whoa, just a background person. <laughs> You're the <laughs> plus one. No? Yeah, <laughs> just a plus one. That's nice. not important. What, what, yeah, that's fine. what are you doing, Tyler? Uh, so, first things are the patio is getting set up right Ooh. away. So, I moved into my house last year, I think. That sounds, sounds about right. I don't know if it's I think so. About about a year. I ruined your floor about a year ago. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I spilled yeah. yeah. like seltzer like water all over his brand new kitchen floor. floor. No, it was in July, yeah. So, that, make, that checks out. So, yeah, we've been in the house for about a year. We haven't done too much on the outside of the house. A lot of the renovations have been inside of the house. And the plan is, one, to finish our patio paver area, which I'm doing all by hand and it's taking a lot longer than anticipated. And the good news is the pavers were delivered on Wednesday of this week. The bad news is I'm gone this weekend. So uh, I guess that's another thing I'm doing is going to Foxwoods to gamble, which is irresponsible. <laughs> wait until you turn 21. <laughs> yeah, wait till you're 21 and be responsible. It's only an issue if you lose. And uh, then when I come back the returning weekend will be the pavers. So I still have to level the sand, put this well, put the sand in, level all the sand. Then we have a base and then we're putting the pavers down and then we're going to be moving all the stuff down. So grills will be in full swing in session for the barbecues of the Ooh. summer, which will be happening quite a bit because I like to grill all the time. This guy's also a pro grill master. He took over yeah. for me at the... Uh, Can't confirm. Last. So uh, I assume barbecues are in your future. Oh man, I really like this podcast. A lot of tire pumping. <laughs> a lot of tire pumping. <laughs> uh, I'm trying to think of like some big things that are going on, but uh, we're putting up a brand new fence. So we'll have a six foot vinyl fence around the house and that'll be a uh, very nice white vinyl. Uh, Good for Bernie. Bernie, yeah. The dog's going to be happy taking Bernie to the park a lot. And on trip wise, we might be going to San Francisco towards mm -hmm. the end of the summer to visit Patrick. So, uh, PK, if Star? you're watching, we'll see. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah. Yes. Uh, it's my buddy that went to Champlain with me, and we do freelance work to this day together. Good guys at my wedding. Nice. So that's uh, a song. How many people did you have in your wedding? I feel like every podcast you're talking about. In the <laughs> I was like, in invited the wedding. To your wedding. <laughs> I had, well, so we had <laughs> eight like two weeks after people. Really started. Yeah, <laughs> we, we had eight people in my wedding party on my side. So I only had eight. So it was sixteen plus us. So wow. 
Uh, we had a lot of people in the party, and then we had over 200 invited. Sheesh. Uh, so we had about 180 some odd after everything was said and done. Wow, yeah. it's a good size. Yeah, nice. it was a uh, the craziest part about that when he was going around and talking and thanking everybody for coming oh, yeah. and we did it table by table. Do PSA. Uh, yeah. So I mean, like we did like a, a general thank you once we cut the cake, and that was fine. But then we really wanted to go around and show our appreciation for coming. Up. A lot of people were flying in from all over the world. Uh, Dang. So, yeah, we gave a gift away for the furthest traveled, which ended up being Australia. Were you so, going nice. most popular in high school? No. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny. I always joke about that with um, working here, like doing the events outside of work. Tyler and, knows everyone. Yeah, uh, I definitely picked that up from my father because uh, he just kind of, I don't want to say the word something, but he's a very good um, straight shooter when it comes to talking. Oh, and, yeah, yeah. And, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. Nice. Yeah. What about you? Yeah, that's cool. I'm boring. I'm working. Um, all summer. I think we're I all just, working yeah. this summer. No, I don't, but like, I'm not doing like anything fun I mean, outside of work. I'm not working. Mackenzie's out. I'm not working. Today's yeah. the last day. I got fired. No, I am not <laughs> That's pretty much all I've done since I was 15 is just, like, work. Um, work. Work, work, more work. Um, I'm going to try to go see song? a couple Sox games. Is it a Rihanna song? Yeah. Work, 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 work. Yeah. So, yeah, I'm, I'm I working. I just finished. Uh, is that Rihanna? <laughs> yeah. Can we confirm? Yeah, it's Rihanna. All right, cool. Yeah. yeah. So, um, I, I'm a country music I guy. actually just heard that's not how you pronounce your name. Oh. Rihanna? It's, re it's no, it's... Re yeah, it's Rihanna. Rihanna. Right? Sorry, we Rihanna. Brie. We have a right. Rihanna, and she took us in. True. Sorry, Rihanna. I yeah. apologize. <laughs> if you ever hear this, if you listen to the College Express podcast, which you should. Yeah. <laughs> Subscribe, like. She definitely listens to us. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, I'm going to be working, probably catch a couple of Sox games. Oh, I um, work there. Yeah, got to run into You Brennan, work hopefully. there? Yeah. Right now? I work for the Sox, yeah. yeah. Side Part muscles. Time. They rock. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, it's pretty sweet. Yeah, the guys that like hold the stuff above their head and walk up and down the, the aisles. Stuff. Oh no, 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 no. Okay. like the a stuff. like a vendor. <laughs> the yeah. hot dogs here. Get your hot dogs. Like, no, no, guys no, must be sweating. Yeah, oh, they are. He's walking all day. I'm Especially like the hot dog guy who's Costumes holding that above his head. Yeah. But my official job title: I'm a Fenway ambassador. Um, just make sure that people are having a good time at the games yeah. and stuff like that. That's it's a fun sad. thing to do. So if you're not having a good time, go just see Brendan. Buy. Yeah. Oh, we have <laughs> leave. We do. We do Get have out. internships every <laughs> summer. I don't think they're paid internships though. But I think we have a lot of high schoolers that end up working for us too. So if you uh, uh, if just you're in the Boston area, yeah. if you're in the Boston area, there's something to do with your summer. It's a really good thing to do for your summer. So it's honestly probably the best atmosphere yeah. for the. The summer is like night games at Fenway Park. Just being in the, yeah. just being in the neighborhood, it's just, just beautiful. I feel like even in general. Sorry. Go ahead. No, I was gonna say even if you're not in the Boston area, yeah. just like travel up here. Yeah, it's spend the summer. Way to be a Red Sox yeah. fan. <laughs> I feel like in general, that's just like World such Series a fun jams. thing to do in the summer. Shout out. Yeah. Is like work for a sports venue. Facts. Um, or not a concert right. venue. I had a friend that did security back in the day, and he, I would run into yeah, him at all the concerts, and he'd be like, what up? Oh, yeah, that's what I'm doing during the oh, summer. I'm going to see the Jonas Brothers. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'm so excited. The Sucker Tour? Was it, was it the Sucker Tour? Is that happiness what Begins. Oh, the Happiness Begins. But that's their new song, is Sucker. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. Cool. <laughs> that's the new song, the Sucker. So, like, I feel that. I get it. Oh, I'm so excited. The new album comes out next month, next week. Can't wait. <laughs> Sing it, Kara. What? No, I'm good. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm also Soccer. a professional uh, watcher when it comes professional to music. Professional watcher. Yeah, <laughs> <not some> watchers. <laughs> when it comes to music. But yeah, concerts are super fun. I'm looking at like other concerts I can go to that are smaller and cost less money. Facts. Did you guys take advantage of that week uh, weekend, the one week where you could buy tickets for $20? I didn't have anyone dollars? that I liked available for 20 bucks. They, good ones. they have a lot sad. of good country artists. I was good. very I'm fired up about country that. Person. Mm. I don't hate it, but I don't love it. Mm. I don't seek it out. Even if you don't We're love country, their apparently. concerts are still fun to go to because it's just like oh, the I went to Country really Fest. Awesome. It was great. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I've only been to like two. Especially in the summer. Concerts Summer's yeah. like men for country concerts. That's not wrong. Yeah. You go to country concerts. country concerts. What? What did you say about country Summer, concerts? it's like, it's men for country concerts. Oh, yeah, concerts. yeah, yeah. It's facts. Yeah. Because every single song is in the country. Is literally Something about, about in the sun. Yeah. Taylor fun in the sun. <laughs> But that's why I like country music. Anybody else country music fan? I am. 
I think I would have been, but I worked at discount. Did you say just kidding? No, no, no. I was oh, like, that's kind of what I was. <laughs> it's like, me. Pick me, pick me. Yeah, you're not. You're definitely not. Uh, no, I used to. He's a jazz. And I do love jazz. Ooh. <laughs> Call back to our old podcast. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, smooth jazz and ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> That's, the, That's the perfect thing to That's do with your I'm, summer. I appreciate that. <laughs> yeah, uh, I worked at Discount Madness for... <laughs> what is that? Since I was 16 and then all the way throughout college, so by the time I left, I was 22. Does that make sense? And they just played country music nonstop all day, so it got to the point where if I didn't know the song, I knew who sang it. And then I just never kept up with it. <laughs> you were I'm really bad Tuxbury. about artists. No, uh, um, so the one in Tuxbury is called Preferred Distributors. Arthur owns both of them, and Discount Arty. is in Pelham. Because that Pelham one's too. going out of business in Texas. Oh, oh, is it? I think really? condos oh. are going to be going out there eventually. Oh, it's always the condos. Oh. It's the circle of life. I worked there like on the summer, and I forget what year it was, but Bobby Reese and I used to go down there and help out at that shop if they needed it, and then come back. But what was your favorite summer job? Greenhouse of Discount Madness. Shout out. Nice. It was awesome. Yeah, just hanging out water plants all day. Got the That's actually a really good question. <laughs> What's everyone's favorite summer job? Yeah. What's your favorite summer job? Oh, uh, mascot. Yeah. Oh, wait, did I even do that during the summer? I don't <laughs> think so. <laughs> yeah, never mind. <laughs> oh. What's yours, Kara? Freedom Trail Tour Guide. Oh, yeah. that's a good one. Yep, yeah, that's still my side hustle, but I, lo- I used to, that's what I did throughout college, was just tour guiding for the summer. It was tons of fun. I met people from all over the world. I made friends, like, I was going on a semester abroad in Ireland, and I met this fa- this group from Ireland, and I was like, let's meet up when you were over there, and it ended up falling through because Facebook did that thing where they hid messages from people you weren't friends with, what? and I didn't see that until I came back, and he's like, oh, yeah, let's meet up when you're in Dublin, and never happened, and I'm very um, mad, but it was still great to, like, meet all these cool people, so, nice. yeah, so yeah. Cool. highly recommended. So can you spit us, like, good five fun facts about the Freedom Trail in, in Boston? Yes, you should go on a tour to take it. <laughs> oh, dang. Oh, oh. Yeah. <laughs> no, no freebies here. <laughs> the Freedom Trail exists. It's yeah, in no Boston. Free, yeah, it's and no it's all the in Boston. No, it ain't. <laughs> Yay, America. <laughs> How much does it cost for the Freedom Trail? $14 for adults, 12 for students, seniors, 8 for children. All right, cool. So it's the $14 uh, okay. dumb trail. What? No. What? For, for $14 any... Freedom, $14 dumb... Sorry, dad joke. Oh. <laughs> I didn't Did not the land. first part, so I was like, no. what's he saying? Yeah. <laughs> Did not land. What's number one? So I had four summer jobs at some point, Jeez. like throughout, since oh. I started high school. Hated all of them. Great. So I guess the like one that I hated the least... <laughs> um, I worked <laughs> at a country club for three or four years, and I was a banquet server. So I got to do like weddings, uh, brush up, brush up, bridal showers. I can't say the word right now. Birthdays, like events like that. That's pretty um, cool. Yes. So it was long hours. Usually it was like 10, 11 hours on my feet for weddings and stuff, but it was kind of cool to see yeah. Yeah. and interact with like the yeah. people for weddings and you always have stories after working a wedding, mm-hmm. dealing with someone. All right, I had one oh, guy yeah. spit on Hit. me. Come on, wow! Let's That's give us, terrible. let's roll it. I had a guy spit on me once. I'm so sorry. Like directly or indirectly? Well, I guess it was on my shoe, but it was directly on my shoe. Oh like my he gosh. spit, like two spit on my shoe. Should have bite your thumb at him. Bite my thumb? Yeah, have you heard yeah. that? Like Hamlet, so I bite my thumb at you. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, see, okay. see, yeah. see. Yeah, that's uh, high schoolers <laughs> will get that one. Well, that's in the remake of the movie. I just remember how ridiculous that was. <laughs> my favorite. I love it so much. It's ridiculous. Oh like, what's happening? I'm so happy you got that reference. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah. No, I didn't do that. <laughs> like the old school middle finger. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> just smiled and walked away. Actually, I also worked on a dock Kept for summer. Was great. <laughs> just say thank you. Be like, oh, this is what we're doing. <laughs> Sitting on each other, okay. That's actually what I was doing, uh, assistant manager at Discount. One of my favorite things was I was the youngest assistant manager at 18, and my friend Matt was 22-ish at the time. And this woman, we have a strict if you break it, you buy it policy, and it's explicitly listed in a breakable section. It's all like glass candles, uh, vases, like, well, not glass candles, but like candle holders, vases, um, all sorts of things that's just easily broken. So uh, I hear something. Broke. No, I hear something <laughs> drop. It's one item. 
costs for like two dollars. They're dirt cheap. Come around the corner, not a big deal. I'll just sweep it up. No one goes, I'm not paying for that. I was like, whoa. Yeah, <laughs> now you are. <laughs> so I was like, yeah, you're, you're paying for that, blah, blah, blah. And she's like, I need to talk to your manager. I'm like, I'm the manager. She's like, no, I need to talk to your direct manager. I was like, okay, hold on. I was like, hey, Matt, you want to play manager today? <laughs> Matt is lower than me on the oh. totem pole. And I just walks around and he's like, yeah, you got to pay for that. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, so, yeah. so, I mean, discount Matt. It's a lot of fun time with it. Yeah. Two dollars, really? Oh, that's yeah, it. that was the thing. It's like because I would have just swept it up, not a big deal. But the fact yeah. that I am not paying for that. <laughs> See, that's the thing. I feel like you would just like treat people like, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Like, right. boom. Yeah, yeah. she would saved her two dollars. That's an iced coffee. <laughs> that's yeah. true. Yeah. You know? Actually, an iced coffee is like two fifty. Two. A small. No, it's nice. almost See, I don't an drink iced coffee. coffee. So I don't know. Is a small two dollars? I don't know. Small three dollars. I, I never get small. <laughs> yeah. Where do you go? Like, Are you a Starbucks girl though? Dunkin' Donuts. Dunkin' Donuts. Well, that Dunkin seems Dunkin like I touched a nerve on that one. <laughs> <laughs> I can't afford Starbucks. Oh. <laughs> Who can? <laughs> but uh, they got good coffee, yeah. too. But what am I doing this summer? Oh, yeah. yeah. I am training my new dog, yeah. Scout, Will Pomsky. All photos for you guys. Uh, do you have an Instagram account? account? <laughs> no? I don't have there's an no, there's no, there's no he Instagram does, account. He does. He just looks like Oh, College oh, yeah, Express has an Express, yeah. oh. I thought you were just talking about it. Oh. <laughs> I, mean, I don't have one. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you work in uh, digital ads and you don't have the Instagram account? Don't have a LinkedIn. Don't have a website. Um, yeah. Dude, that's like the equivalent of not owning a social security number. I love that. Yeah, I'm off the grid, baby. <laughs> Good on you, mate. Good on you. Yeah. So, yeah, a lot of dog training, a lot of dog training. Um, I'm moving home. Nice. Right? I'm going back home to Milford. Um, Wait, moving out of the apartment that you're in? Yeah, I'm getting out of Somerville. Yeah. Getting out of Somerville. Boston okay. apartment's really expensive, you guys. Uh, oh, yeah. Definitely back to those summer, job, summer jobs. Save up that money. Don't go to Foxwoods and gamble it all away. Go to Foxwoods and make more of it. <laughs> Just kidding. Was that like a zing attack? <laughs> <laughs> I think the last three times I've come positive, so I'm, yeah. I'm feeling confident. Yeah, they say it's only yeah. an issue if you lose. But... Uh, yeah, just right. kidding. Actually, probably save up your money. Yeah, no, definitely save up your money. Uh, yeah. Sebago Lake, that's definitely going up there. A lot of rounds of golf, that's definitely on the agenda. Oh, you golf? Going to, of course. We're talking ladies' <laughs> golf? <or laughs> golf? <laughs> both. Yeah. Why limit yourself? Why limit yourself? Yeah. Do both. The girlfriend did beat me last time in mini golf, soft spot. She also hit like five holes in one, so it was like impossible that's to beat. I feel like yeah. girls always win at me. We're just better. It's yeah. fine. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, pinch the nerve there. <laughs> yeah. Maybe I did give her a couple of extra strokes that oh, I shouldn't sure. have done. Mm. That's what they tell themselves. Yeah, yeah exactly. That's, that's how I get to sleep at night, you know? Of course. <laughs> it gives me those cold shivers. What else? Hmm. <laughs> We're going definitely going to Sebago Lake from question number one, probably two, and question number three, probably squeaked in there as well. <laughs> um, Cape. Go oh, to yeah. Mayflower Beach. Go to the Cape. Facts. Dennis, Mayflower Where's Beach. <laughs> oh. Where on your arm? There it is. Not there as big is. as it used to be. Yeah. I think it's here, right? Is this yeah, right? it's like in, on the inside. Yeah. The inside? Like yeah. Right up, right the inside. Right at the yeah. cusp of the bicep and yeah. the no muscle right there. Let's uh, let's see. What else is on the, the agenda for the summer? Going to a concert. I think we're looking at Florence and the Machine. Oh, nice. I think that's what we're looking at. Um... Just did our Burlington trip, as we did in intros, or whenever we did that. That was a lot of fun. Burlington, <laughs> yeah. Vermont, first time I've ever been. Unreal place. Nice. Mm -hmm. It's pretty cool, yeah. It's so nice. Yeah. Did so. you guys get on the lake at all? Oh, we did the, we did a, we did a, like, a lunch cruise. Oh, nice. Those are always do you fun. Know, do you know it's, yeah. which one? It was, like, the Ethan yep. Allen yeah. boat Yep, boat that's, the, um, that's, the, that's the, um, when you graduate from Champlain, yeah. When you graduate from Champlain, they put you on a cruise. Uh, for the senior for senior week, and that's yeah, that's the that's the thing. That's they also do it at night for orientation. Did they do that for you? What? Yeah, yeah, freshman year orientation, we that's all got so on the boat. Fun. It was great because it was a whole bunch of like yeah, great. 17, 18 year olds like trying to dance on the boat, and it's dark, and we're like we've never been to a club or anything, so it was uh, great. Do you guys ever find sure. Champ? Champ, oh. of monster. course. I found him every morning before breakfast, looking out at the lake. Just pops up for quick second. <laughs> you play with me. Yeah. You guys are friends. <laughs> <Yeah. Never saw. laughs> I didn't know that Lake Champlain had a sea monster until I went of on. Of course. Until I went on to that to that nice little boat cruise. Yeah. We also did a what was supposed to be a four point five mile hike, 
on, I think it was Mount Mansfield. It was yep. like the elephant's head trail. Yeah. And uh, that turned into an eight-mile hike. We took a couple wrong turns. That'll um, happen. <laughs> it was supposed to be a loop, too. And it did, did we, uh, we did not was end it up, up a where mountain car was. That, or was it just a hill? It was a mountain. Oh, yeah. No, it was a mountain. You know, they don't have hills up there, except I in Burl- Burlington hill. is a hill. And then everything around it is a mountain. Fast. Yeah. yeah, it took a couple of diggers. Going down I was great. not Coming prepared. Back. Coming back is the worst, and no matter what it is you're going up Mount something, Mount Maine, Mount Spruce. Yeah. Mount Spruce was the worst. I had friends. I would go stay at their place because I would like we do homework and hang out or whatever, and then it'd be one o'clock in the morning. I'm tired. I don't want to walk up the hill. So I'd sleep there. The next morning we go to class, <laughs> and it would be up Mount Spruce, which is like this. Yeah. Sheesh. And. Every time you, it was like, though. yeah, it was like in the in <laughs> dreams where you're like, I'm almost at the end of the tunnel, and then the tunnel gets longer. Yeah, mm-hmm. see, see Bentley, Bentley University, we had uh, what we called an upper part of campus and a lower part of campus, and we had we had a hill that you had to climb up. It was probably, I mean, it was a small campus; you could get anywhere you wanted to in about 15 minutes. But going from lower to upper was it was it was a pretty good it was a pretty good incline. But we're not talking mountainous over here, yeah. fresh. <laughs> Freshman fifteen was not really a thing. It was more like freshman ten. Thank you to the thank you to that little extra hike that you yeah. have going on. So definitely appreciate yeah. that level of steepness. Yep. Especially after going. You're on. right. If you're looking for colleges, down. yeah. While you're looking at colleges this summer, check out the landscape. Are you going to be climbing up a lot of hills? Are you going to be climbing up very? <laughs> Do they have a hills? bus? That will take Do you they have a bus? Uh, Is it see. flat? Can you use a scooter or a bike or yeah, roller yeah. skates or something? Burlington allowed you to toss your bike right on the bus. Yeah. Which is great. Yeah. Isn't it like UMass Amherst that is like one part of campus? It's like a 30 minute drive away from another part of campus? I something? would believe it. UMass Amherst is most of Amherst, Massachusetts, except for like, what, two other a small neighborhood. liberal arts colleges? <laughs> and a neighborhood. Yeah. <laughs> I was out that way last year for a wedding, and I drove through Amherst College, and then I looked over, and they're like, you messed that way, and I'm like, no, that's, I can't deal no. with that. I graduated with um, 300 people in my high school senior class, yeah. and 30 of them went to UMass Amherst. Sounds so about like, right. Li- literally 10%. Yeah. 10% most, of yeah. our graduating most class went of- to UMass Amherst. I feel like that's like Massachusetts. If you're going to UMass, like I, I just immediately assume it's UMass Amherst, and then they'll be like, "Oh, blah blah blah, blah, blah. I'm like, "Right, that exists." No, oh, I forgot. I forget, Dartmouth. I keep forgetting about UMass Bar- Boston. I'm like, In Lowell. "Oh, In Lowell. that's the one I think of after Shut Amherst up. as well." Yeah, because I'm from Tewksbury. So. Yeah, yeah. Tuxbury. I feel like yeah, Dartmouth. It is Tewksbury. It is Tewksbury. 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 Like Tuka Rask. Tuka. Exactly. Oh, uh, the boys, they need to do a little bit better. Uh, what else? What else? Let's see. I right, did a wedding. <laughs> did a wedding. Wedding anyway, was fun. Uh, crashed? Did not. I was a friend. I was a friend. Friend of a friend. Yeah, friend of a friend of a friend of a friend. Wedding crashed was a great movie. Basically crashed. <laughs> Basically crashed it. No, but it was actually, uh, it was a lot of fun. Yeah. Uh, definitely. What else? I think uh, that might be it. Yeah. Thanks for asking us what our summers are like. No one asks us that kind of stuff. Yeah, yeah we appreciate so it.